we got new content kind of this is some of the stuff that was supposed to drop at the start of season two and they're only about uh, a week late but we finally saw the release of two new game modes that being gun game and grind and just in case you don't know uh gun game you start with like some pistol or whatever and you move your way up through a bunch of different weapons getting a new weapon every time you get a kill uh this is one of my favorite party game modes and i'm glad that it's finally back and grind is kind of like kill confirmed except you need to take all those dog tags and bring them to a specific spot to get the points for them and they finally replaced the season two mosh pit with dome 24 7 which is probably what they should have done from the start honestly don't like playing on the map museum i think it looks really cool not that fun to play on at least 6v6 also obvious oral joke and before we hop into game here feel free to skip forward if you just want to see gameplay but i have a theory so my theory is with the way this ui is you only really see four playlists here at the start you have to scroll over to see the rest so some people don't even think infected is in the game anymore same with third person so my conspiracy theory is that with how the ui is structured they're going to be removing playlists left and right with every like new update that comes out because there isn't really room to see them all in the first place and they're going to take that as low player numbers for those modes oh people don't want to play them let's get them out instead of it just being more visible to people like in model for 2019 they had them all down like the left side of the screen and you could read and see each playlist here like i said you only see three of them plus the quick play so i have a feeling they're gonna be removing and replacing a lot of love playlists in the future but that's enough of my conspiracy theories let's go ahead and hop into gun game okay my first gun game and i'm in one in progress where somebody already has 15 weapons that's that's cool yeah throw me in a party game in progress where i have to drop a nuke to win so far first impression already not very good as much as i love this mode being able to join a game in progress is just awful and that's game i'm glad i could enjoy my 20 seconds of gameplay oh but it ends with a throwing knife i'm in all right now we're gonna get our first official game of gun game and i swear if i don't win i'll be very disappointed in myself there we go now who wants to get shotgunned in the mouth anybody there we go and that's another oh almost had three in a row okay so it doesn't really seem to be going by like weapon type we went smg to one shotgun to ar and now to a marksman this is interesting this would have been a cool day to drop the crossbow oh i can't aim i'm gonna be stuck on this thing i need to hit a shot oh there we go hit one shot but it wasn't enough there we go oh now we're on pistol okay pistol's pretty far into this and what's this the x13 oh yeah there we go oh now we're on the 74u what was i using earlier there we go. Under the MP7. Come back here. Hey. There we go. Barely. Oh, the RPG. They got launchers in this? Oh, they definitely do. Oh, nice. I wasn't done reloading my RPG. I hate the reload mechanics in this game. They're not good. Oh, and a hit marker too. Might as well just give them bomb squad while you're at it. Is this guy already on the knife? There we go. Oh, hit a shot challenge. There we go. On the RPK. There we go. On to the next. What? Oh, that's bullshit. I call bullshit. And that's game. Damn. I got seventh? Uh-uh. I'm playing this till I win. And something that I saw on Twitter earlier today, uh, a lot of COD people talking about it, is that the minimap is like a classic minimap. You see dots on the screen already. Like, it works how everyone wanted the minimap to work. Maybe this is them testing it. Maybe it's like... A, a, a glitch maybe they didn't mean for it but this proves that it can work in this game there's no reason for it to not be here but old mini map new mini map it don't matter i'm winning this Woo! everyone in here is just moaning oh geez maybe i should be moaning maybe it's giving them power Ooh. Oh, wait, what? A grenade launcher? Is the weapon order just random every time? That's actually kind of fun. It's better than predetermined, I think. Whoa, whoa, I just killed him with bouncing it off him. It didn't even have to explode. I'm nasty like that. Okay, we're still in first for now. Let's keep the momentum going. Oh, Jesus, aim. Oh, another sniper? Oh, it was there. The shot was there. Come on. I'm only tied for first now. There we go. Got to take back my place at the throne. Who wants the shotgun? Hmm? Who wants it? There we go. There we go. Oh, we're on the knife. Ooh, missed the throwing knife. Fuck. We're tied. 17-17. Both on the throwing knife. Three people tied. Oh, there it is, baby. Let's go. Wait, what? The mission is complete. Well done. Second? But 
Is the throwing knife not the win? He must have hit it a second before me. Oh, that's lame. I was robbed. It didn't even count my kill. Hold on. I, I'm, not, I'm not done yet. I need to go in and win one of these. I don't care how long it takes. Oh, we're popping off though. Oh, keep it going. Oh, we're still going. There we go. There we go. I'm going to be saying that a whole lot. Because all I do is get kills. That's all I do. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, got the deagle kill. Oh, I missed the throwing knife, though. Let me pick it back up. Okay, all right. That's for you. Free. That's one eight, though. Oh, let's go, baby. Finally got it. After getting robbed. Watch this. Eat it. Right in the mouth. Oof. In the shoulder, actually. It says I had 14 melees, but I definitely did not. All right, that's enough of gun game. Let's see what grind's all about. And for grind, uh, let's pick a weapon to grind. And the weapon we'll be using is the cast off 7 for you, and this is the build. I'm pretty sure this is close to getting the mastery done, so might as well. All right, we got grind on Turok. We're also joining another game in progress, but isn't that far ahead. And we're already getting smacked. Give me all of these. Let's try to bring them to the bank. And we're dead. Do you get XP every time you pick up the dropped tags? Like, even if they're not your own? So I'm getting 25 for each of, like, the normal tags, but not the banked ones. Like, when I killed that dude earlier, it was, like, his tag and then all the tags he picked up. Like, they look different. So let's see if I can find somebody with a bunch of them. Oh, well, there's one for you. Can I climb this? I can. Sick. Okay, so do I get it for this? Oh, you do. This is probably the mode to level up weapons, I'm not gonna lie. If you got a double weapon XP, hop in here with whatever weapon you're trying to level up and just pray that you get a smaller map than this. Oh, and I wonder if I die, can I pick up all the tags that I dropped and will I get XP again for them or no? Because that'd be an easy way to farm XP. You put down like attack inserted part of the map that nobody's at. You just get a few kills. You just keep taking yourself out with like Molotovs or nades. Could be kind of a juicy way to level up your gun. I can't even find anybody to take out. Oh, it's a Claymore. And there's another one. Oh, and they shot an RPG down. They really don't want people going up that building. Imagine hopping in a game mode called grind just to camp. Well, they could be grinding long shots, you know. I, I can't hate the grind, but I will. Let's check in on the building again. Claymores are back. Oh, we got one of the kills. They're just like sitting there at the top of the stairs. I guess I could keep feeding them kills or I could just go to do my own thing. But back to the weapon XP thing. Like I mainly played kill confirmed. I did the whole decoy thing. Like just trying to toss decoys everywhere to get the little extra XP and then pick up all the tags that I saw. And this, I can get the tags off somebody that died like all this. I just got 100 XP just for running. And then how much XP do I get for banking the tags? Oh, I guess we'll never know because you can double dip on all the XP because if you're killing somebody and they're dropping multiple tags, so you're getting a hundred points for each kill on top of like however many tags they have. That's good XP. Oh, and a nice throwing knife too. Oh, fuck you. What are you doing there? So let's see. Give me these tags. So that's 50 XP just for picking them up. And let's see if I can bank them before I die. Oh yeah. 50 XP per tag banked. This is the XP mode. So honestly, I don't know how much longer this mode's gonna be in the game. I know they just added it in, but the way COD throws in modes and then throws them out, I would hop on here and try to level up your weapons immediately. Whatever you gotta get done, get it done. Cause I only have like six kills this game, but that doesn't even matter. The amount of XP I picked up, I have enough XP for like 10 plus kills. But if it works anything like how Kill Confirmed did, this is just XP city. You're sitting on a mound of XP. What's up with these guys in fucking claymores? It's working, but like, who does this? And that's the game. We finished it with just nine kills, but with five scores, that's a lot of XP sitting there. I'm not going to do the math, but it's a hundred for each nine. So 900 plus five scores, 50 each. I passed the math on to you. You guys, you know, the savings travel to you. But there you have it. There's the two new modes. Gun game's pretty fun, even if you get robbed from a rightful W that you should have. And grind's really good for XP. On top of that, they got Dome 24-7. So those of you that ain't getting any head, go ahead, hop on there. And overall, these modes, eh, they're pretty fun. Uh, gun games, way more fun than I think Grind is, but Grind is obviously there just to grind. But I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate all your support. It truly means the most to me. And I will see you guys next time. Later.